Over 300 years ago, the Church of England held services in Oyster Bay, led by missionaries from the Society for the Propagation of the Gospel in Foreign Parts. This congregation founded Christ Church in 1705, making it one of the oldest parishes in Long Island. The first building erected here in about 1707 served as both a town hall and a church. A second church, more ecclesiastical in design, was built here in 1750. During the Revolutionary War, it was used by occupying British and Hessian forces as a soldier's barracks. They left it in such a deteriorated state that by 1801 it had to be demolished. In 1802, the Oyster Bay Academy was established in the two-story building you see at the end of the drive. Students attended classes here until a public school was built in the 1840s on South Street. At that time, the old academy building became the Christ Church Rectory. The congregation had been dormant for over 40 years when they reorganized in 1843. By 1844, they had built their third church building on this site. A little over 30 years later, they erected this fourth church, which began as a charming wooden Gothic-style building. In 1925, it was greatly enlarged and encased in stone, becoming the structure you see today. Those additions also included striking stained glass windows, modeled after the Chart Cathedral in France. One of the finest pipe organs on Long Island was installed in 1986, a beautiful Helmuth Wolf organ, to complement Christ Church's extensive music program. Parts of the 1878 church are still visible, notably the wood trusses in the nave and a small section of original pews. These were the Roosevelt family pews when Theodore Roosevelt, his wife Edith, and their children lived at Sagamore Hill during his presidency. President Roosevelt attended church here, and although he never formally joined, his wife and children were active members of Christ Church from the 1880s on. Upon his death in 1919, a simple funeral service for T.R. was held here, before his body was laid to rest in nearby Young's Memorial Cemetery. Plaques in memory of many members of the Roosevelt family are mounted on the wall near the old pews. And all around the church are other memorials dedicated to Christ Church members, many of whose names are familiar as place names in the community, such as Underhill, Fleet, Townsend, Beekman, Weeks, and Youngs, to name only a few. Christ Episcopal Church has been a part of the history of Oyster Bay for over three centuries and continues to grow and flourish in the heart of the village.